The cult started from a desire to build a hockey stick that could withstand the pressures of the roughest game in the world. Up until now, players have been sent into battle with inadequate tools. Sticks that deliver top tier feel with laughable durability. Sticks are not only breaking on slap shots, they're breaking while receiving passes and through the simplest forms of contact. How are athletes expected to compete at a world-class level with house league equipment? The Colt was developed to be the world's first high-performance hockey stick, innovatively engineered without compromising weight or durability. Finally, we found an answer to one of hockey's biggest problems. I used to play hockey, and just like everyone else, I would run through a lot of sticks. They would either wear down in a short period of time or fail catastrophically when I needed them the most. Several times a season, I'd be forced to replace sticks that I'd spent a lot of money on. I got tired of this and decided to look for a better way. I wanted a stick that would remain lightweight, as flexible as a composite, but would actually last. After researching the way modern sticks are made, I began sourcing new materials and trying new things. After countless attempts, there was nothing that added durability and strength to the stick without adding weight and compromising performance. I began thinking it wasn't possible. One day though, I came across a photo in the National Post about this. It all began to make sense. A regular ping pong ball that can withstand hundreds of pounds of force, coated with a thin metal that didn't compromise weight. And just like that, I was introduced to the world of nanomaterials. I thought, if they could do that to a ping pong ball, what could they do for a hockey stick? I contacted the people responsible and learned that their material was being used for aerospace and medical devices, even a few sporting goods. I knew it would be a long shot, but I decided to suggest my idea anyways. Although they were skeptical at first, they gave it a shot. And after two months, it became a labor of love. We had several prototypes developed and began testing them with the help of ice and ball hockey players from around the city. The initial reviews were through the roof. It motivated us to work harder, utilizing every available technological process at our disposal. We didn't rest until we were confident that we had created a world's first. A high performance hockey stick that excelled in all environments, handling intense gameplay with ease. The Colt is a Canadian handcrafted hockey stick, crafted by engineers who share a passion for the game we love. No details were spared in ensuring that performance quality was not compromised. The Colt flexes, cradles the ball or puck with sublime control and feels like a regular elite composite, with one major difference. Unlike a composite, the Colt's performance is not dictated by the gameplay environment. Whether it's used on traditional ice surfaces, polished concrete, or even in an impromptu game of street hockey, the Colt keeps the athlete in control. The Colt is constructed with a high-performance nanomaterial that allows it to demonstrate the same strength ratios as industrial steel while maintaining the lightweight flexibility of the elite composites currently on the market. The engineering of the Colt ensures that the bottom of the blade no longer splinters after normal gameplay, as well stabilizes the toe of the blade for a strong and accurate shot. Our product is now in the final prototyping stage and we need your help. Your donation will provide the necessary means to take our idea, one that combines Canadian engineering innovation with our uniquely Canadian traditions, to the next level. With the funds received through Kickstarter, we will be able to develop a final product, utilizing the most lightweight base materials available and begin mass producing the Colt so that the entire country can have the opportunity to experience a new age in sport and technology.